Hey guys, it's me. If you're back here, and welcome back to another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle. And today, guys, we are going to be talking about Bio Brawly in specific because I feel that, in my opinion, he is very underrated because of the fact that his passive skill is not something that you see every day okay like usually we are accustomed to cards that either provide an attack boost or in defense boost or cards that provide attack boost for all allies or cards that provide key but this guy is a little bit different okay at first sight he would look like a card that is actually not useful at all but when you think about it he's actually good now before I continue, I would like to say his passive skill, okay? His passive skill is as follows. When facing one opponent, his defense increases by 100% but his attack reduces by 50%, okay? But when he faces two or more enemies at scenarios like the World Tournament, his own attack increases by 100% but his defense reduces by 50% and in case you did not know he has a supreme damage multiplier and his 12 key multiplier is 135% according to Dokkan battle wikia okay so his passive skill is kinda different compared to the cards that we have seen in the past and the reason why I feel that people will ignore him is because of the fact that he loses his own attack by 50% and don't get me wrong, okay, like 50% reduction in attack is not small. I understand the fact that it's a lot of damage lost for defense, but consider this, okay, like we don't know who the extreme tech lead is, okay, like he might be Frieza or he might be someone else, which we don't know, but the biggest advantage that Brawly has is his link set because he has both revival and nightmare and if i remember correctly these links are kind of common in extreme type cards and if i remember correctly it also implies the extreme tech type cards as well but the purpose of making this video is simply to pass this message okay like bio brawly is not bad he is not perfect, okay? Like, he might not be in the best, the perfect tech team. But he is a good alternative if you don't have the right cards in your box, okay? And this is assuming the fact that the extreme tech lead would have links like Revival and Nightmare. And this guy will also be useful in the world tournaments because he gets an attack boost of 100. And hey, he's a free to play card who is a TUR, so there's that advantage as well. So I feel like I have shared the message that I want to share and that pretty much concludes this video. And let me know in the comment section below regarding how you feel about Bio Brawly and I want to hear your thoughts. So thank you guys for watching, subscribe for more content and smile if you're signing off. And remember as I always say guys that your life is special and make the best out of it. Peace.